Hey guys, we're on floor for your Nidhogg again. Um, I've been having a glitch. I believe it's a glitch. I'm not sure. Um, when I use this for the buff that you have to do with him, um, I'll alt, alt, pierce, and then kill. And for whatever reason, it locks out all of my skills. And I'm not sure if that's a glitch or if it's not a glitch. So we're gonna find out, we'll see if it'll do it again. I used the debuff card this time to lock out the skills. Okay, so it did not lock anything out this time, but um, there is a glitch. Like, I, I know that these lock out, but the attack skills locked out as well, which made no sense to me. So if anybody could let me know what was going on there, I'd really appreciate it. All right, so we're gonna do this and this. We're just gonna give everybody a turn so we don't get it. That way we don't have any darkness. I can put her, her stuff up, heal up. She getting hit like a truck. She might die. All right. So we can't stop the alt. Oh, well, we can stop the alt. But it's gonna hurt. I'm gonna do this and this. Yeah, nothing I can do because I I'm not getting I'm getting shit for cards every time. Oh my god, this is so bad. Like I watch Marley get good RNG. I watch Amazing get good RNG. I watch Callius get good RNG. Why can't I like get it like once every once in a while? Um, I think I'm gonna give up on this. I think I'm gonna give up on floor three. This was a waste of my money to buy my L for this. I literally spent money on my L for this. And I can't seem to win. So, I don't know. I'm gonna use her card for her, increase her stat buffs, cause she seems to get trounced all the time. Uh oh, I got a Pierce card on the second turn. That means I'm gonna, it's gonna take another 15 minutes to half an hour to get two more cards.
Can I get one Elizabeth card? Like one, just one. No. Cannot. I actually need to attack with her for the lifesteal. It's not that I want to attack with her. It's, uh, she's getting hit like a truck, and I don't get Elizabeth cards to heal. She's probably dead. Gonna save my L card. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this for lifesteal. To build up her passive. What do we have? Four, this will max out her passive. Hey, she's got HP now. Oh, 350-105 is the cap for first round, by the way. Get too many of her cards. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Alright, so we'll latte Elizabeth Elizabeth and a latte. Because I had so many options there. Uh, 
might as well give a solidify if I since I can. Just so she takes less damage. Excuse me. I might as well take the attack down since I can't. Uh... Just waiting for that one card, the one that's 12.5% in quotation marks 12.5 because it's actually like 1% in this fight. I think I'm going to make a, an algorithm to, to, to find out what the actual percentage is on average. Alright, now we can finally prepare to move to next phase. So we can't stop the alt. Sorry about that. All right, so that's all with my own. Do this, do this, and heal. Should be able to take him off this turn. I think. <coughs> uh, really? All right, so. My L. My L. Liz. And that just in case I I I don't um, kill. Yeah, 
I'm glad I did it that way. Bring it back up to 16. I'd rather bring it back up than... Oh, come on, be nice. Leave her alone. That X store, I gotta get rid of it. I, I, I haven't had a purify. Alright, so... One. Two. Three. Four. So we're going to work on, I'm going to start working on more alts here. All right, so we're going to alt, uh, actually we're going to save my alts alt. We're going to heal. We're going to save that that card and we're gonna pierce um, and the reason I'm saving this is because I, I can't get her alt yet so I'll I'll get rid of the extort with the purify if everybody can live okay Everybody did live, so we're gonna we're gonna alt, we're gonna purify, we're gonna heal, and burn this. See, the healing in the buffs is where you, you really take it down. All right, so we're going to do this, this. to use her card to stop the darkness because it's going to attack her. We should be able to kill this next turn if I can get one more healer buff. Okay, great. That's perfect right there. Heal. Heal. What's its HP at? One? One. So. I'm just gonna get Liz's alt back. And uh, 
actually no let's do it this way heal this buff no I don't want to hmm. Let's see if that kills. I want to see if that kills. Did not. Did not kill. That was my own mistake. I should have reset it. I should have reset it. I should have reset it. All right. Over the stance, alt, use this and use this. We'll see if <clears throat> last time I did it this way, everything locked out, so we'll see. So let's see what locks out. Just the healing and debuff. All right, I'll pause the video again and we'll see you in a little bit. All right, guys, we're back at 4 3. So <clears throat> the goal for 4 3 is you need to do 10% damage each and every round. That's what we're going to try to do. There we go. We got some good damage there. Now, once you get rid of these after doing 10% damage every round, he will get a stat bonus increase. The reason why I left that just like it is, um, he also has, I believe it is on this turn. He can rank down, I believe it is this turn. Or maybe not. All right, he is gonna alt. This should do um, 10%. Well now, okay. Not sure where the rank down is yet. Um,
right, so after this turn, he's going to get a big stat boost. Now you still have to do 10% damage per round. We're going to move this. So we cancel stance, do this, down to two <clears throat> although I'm not sure if I can take him down this turn it'll be real 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 close Oh, we got there. Okay, fantastic. That uh, hurt. Hopefully, it doesn't kill anybody. I really want to save my L's alt for next turn just in case I don't get a card. So I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to pray the abyss. Does the proper damage. Oh, we didn't get there. So it's going to go back up 10%. But I was worried I wasn't going to get a Freja card to cancel stance next turn. And I shouldn't have because I got one. Alright, so he's going to go back down this time. We'll rebuff this, we'll do this and this just in case I need her all back. Alright, so we're gonna do we're gonna do this. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. That should be more than enough damage. 
and we got the heel and then we get rid of the alt we have a stance cancel card that's fantastic we're just right now we're just trying to take him down as quickly as we can do this take away the alt burn the Mael card and burn the Elizabeth card I should have went for the win I should have went for the win alright guys we're gonna go for the win here We are gonna go for the win. If it doesn't work, we'll back up and keep going. Come on, Freja. Come on, Freja. Come on, Freja. Yes, finally. The torture is over. <clears throat> All right, guys, and that's the video for Nidhogg, Floor 3. It was not fun. <laughs> it was and it wasn't. So that's how it works. Uh, have fun. We'll talk to you later.